guys, fellow farmers, ranchers, outdoors people, hobby, whatever. Alec Pierce at the ranch. I'm inside. I'm kind of excited today. I got a, a, an early Christmas present. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So just arrived today. Um, now you already know, you go back to my, what was that, number six, Kevin? Number six of my uh, at the ranch uh, episodes way back, I don't know, a couple years ago. Number six. And it was called, what was it called? Weather, Weather Station. Look for Weather Station. I think that's what it was. Uh, you look for a weather station. You may, re in fact, I'm sure a lot of you recall it because we've had a heck of a lot of uh, views and comments on that, like thousands. And it was about uh, it was about the very excellent Davis Instruments Vantage View Weather Station. You may remember this now. And and it, it, it's two components. Remember, there's this part right here, the Weather View console that sits in the, in the house. That actually this actually normally sits beside my bedside table. It sits there and it has a screen and the buttons on it. And then the other part, the neat part, is up on the roof of the house. You may remember the picture of me this summertime, and I was standing on the roof of the house and showing you how the anemometer spins and the wind, the wind direction and how the rain collector and all that neat stuff is up there. And it stays up there. Solar batteries. I never go up there if I don't have to. I never change the batteries. I don't do anything. It just sits there and spins in the wind. And it sends information down every few seconds. It sends information down. And can you see that, Kevin? That little, that little transmitter tower right there. It looks like a transmitter tower and it's got little ears yep. like it's throwing up. That's how often it does it. So one, every three or four seconds, it sends out fresh information. So I know, for instance, right now, the wind is very, very low. It's only one mile an hour. And it's coming from the northwest. Went to two miles. Just doubled. The wind speed just doubled. The high for 2019, 89. Can you see that, Kevin? 89 was the high here at the ranch. That's warm. I don't care you guys in California and Florida. 89 degrees. Hello. It's great. Uh, let's look at the low. The low is minus 18. Now, this is Fahrenheit, by the way. You guys use Celsius. You'll have to put your fancy formula in there and change it. Minus 18. Doesn't matter. Fahrenheit, centigrade, it's cold. So that's the range we have here from plus 90 to minus 20, typically in a, in a year. But anyway, the point is that this, uh, this little weather station has been fantastic. And um, I don't work for Davis Instruments, but I've been really, really happy with it. We've had this now for a long time. Got to be. We've been here for 20 years, Kevin. I bet you've been up there for 10 or 12, maybe more. So this is not new at all, and, and they've been really good. I broke one little piece on it on the anemometer. The thing that read the speed, and I called them about it, and they sent me a new one in the mail. No charge, no shipping, just put it in, instructions to double do. Good company. But anyway, the other day, uh, um, Doug, chap the name of Doug down there, called me and said, Alec, we have a new device to attach to your uh, Vantage View to update it, bring it up to 2019 standards, whatever that is. And he said, I think you really, really enjoy it. And he said, I'm going to send you one. And, uh, and uh, if you like it, hook it up, see if it works, let me know. And if you want to put it on one of your videos, that'd be great. And if you don't like it, send it back. So uh, we don't get paid for any of this. I won't be keeping this, but, um, but I thought I'd give it a try. So here it is. This is what you get. So this is called the Davis Weather Link Live. It's called Davis Weather Link. Download the Weather Link app. Go to Accounts. Step by step. Okay, so I get my phone out of here, and uh, the download of the WeatherLink app. It looks like this. And welcome to WeatherLink. So that's about it right there. And then uh, it, let's let's uh, let's look at the weather. And you go to settings, little thing there. I'm going to say it's okay. It says put the batteries in. So you put batteries in here. Oh yeah, you don't need the batteries right away, but we'll put the batteries in anyway. Four batteries, four double A's go in the bottom. That's simple enough. And then it says. Uh, Plug, uh, plug the system in, so we better do that, make sure this is working properly. <clears throat> we'll plug this in, that goes into there, and that goes into there. This is pretty simple. Yeah, step two, plug the system in, we'll plug that into there, that's pretty simple. And this is American made, so the plug's not even polarized, but I guess they're really careful down there. And then plug that into the weather link, like so. And take a look at it. And uh, what do you put? Blinking blue light. Okay, blinking blue light. Now let's go to the app and see what it says to do here. Let's see. Let's check the weather. Okay, so we go over there. And uh, there's my account number. And my name's already in there. And it just goes like that. It's just about that simple.
That couldn't be much simpler, could it? There it is. What have we got? 39 degrees. Let's do a look at this, Kev. 39 degrees. Can you see that? Yeah. Well, I can't let see. Let me flip this one else. Forecast, seven-day forecast. So this is Wednesday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Say so right for the whole week, forecast, temperatures, and, and precipitation. Oh, it accesses automatically. I think it accesses my Wi-Fi. That was easy. Outside temperature, 39, 91%. 91, look at that. It's the same information. Inside, 73. That's just 76. This is 73. I guess it has to update a bit, does it? And then 35% humidity. And feels like temperature. What's that say? Uh, rain. No rain right now. On the Wind, 3 miles an hour. North, northwest, one mile an hour north. Oh, that changes though, doesn't it? Wind gust to four, oh, yeah, back to one. Keep the phone down so I can see it. Oh, there you go, yeah. And that's the wind speed. Yep, look at that. Hold it still. Hold it still. I don't want to hold still. I'm having fun here. I can't one, focus. one mile an hour west wind speed, two mile an hour. The phone is faster than the console sometimes. That's amazing. Look at that. Bar barometric pressure, 30.11, 30.12. So anyway, so the beauty of this is, is the chap on the phone was telling me is, this is my mobile phone. I can go to Florida. I can go to California. I can go to South Africa, all the places I go to and love. And I can check on the temperature here at the ranch. Now, I'm not too sure if, if that's a big deal. But I do know and it happens all the time around the world, as you know, these days, that you hear about storms, bad storms, maybe flooding, occasionally fires and other things. Now, we're very fortunate here in Ontario. We don't really suffer from any calamities. We don't get tornadoes or flooding or hurricanes or any of that kind of stuff. But still, if you wanted to check on your property, if you were a farmer living somewhere, maybe in the, in the, mid in the Midwest or in the, in the North or in, in, the, in California someplace, a farmer, landowner of any sort, you wanted to check, is my property okay? And if you had the, uh, the Vantage View with this new weather link, you could just go to your phone and see everything. It tells you the maximums, the minimums, all the same information on there. Ah, you see the wind just went up a little bit, two miles, two miles an hour, two miles an hour. That was the easiest setup I've ever had, Kevin. That's easier than putting a DVD in for a movie. Rainfall. So there you go. It's just that easy. So here's that fantastic Vantage View weather station. Totally wireless, you see. This is plugged in right now, but it has batteries. And this sits by my bedroom. And the, the, the sensors are upstairs. Tells you all your weather information. And now with this new device, uh, this weather link and the app, I can tell you what's happening at the ranch right here. Anytime from anywhere in the world. 74 degrees. 76, it says there, 39, 39. That's pretty amazing, eh, Kev? Yeah. And that was certainly an easy setup. Oh, and you know what else I should tell you is that um, the chap at Davis Instruments said that they have a special promotion on them. I don't work for them. I don't care what you do. I do know that this has been really, really good for me and my family and our animals here at our ranch. And this is a neat device. I just uh, might consider buying, buying this myself. It's not very expensive. I'm not sure what it is, but I know these apps and the hardware is not very expensive. But um, uh, uh, he did tell me they have a promotion on. So perhaps you, I'll, I'll put the link on the, on the screen. Uh, Kevin, you need to put that on Davis Instruments. I think it is davisinstruments.com. And there's a special contest they have. And if you enter the contest, I don't think there's anything you have to do to buy anything. Enter the contest, and you might win a complete package. You're worth about 600 bucks, the whole thing, everything. Uh, you might win one of those. So it's a special promotion. On. It's only on to the end of the year, so you need to do it very quickly. But that's, that's pretty slick, Kevin. That's pretty good. Next time I'm in South Africa, I can keep track of the ranch. Pretty neat. So there's an upgrade, an update uh, uh, for my uh, Vantage View from Davis Instruments. It looks pretty neat to me. It sure is easy to set up. That's for sure. And I know, I noticed on the box, there's a phone number too. If you have a problem, just call them. And if I know Davis Instruments, they'll do a great job of taking care of you. That's one thing I do know. They're very, very good folks. Anyway, there you go. A little uh, reminder about the weather station, which is great. And now that you can get this weather link app. Don't forget about that contest too. I told them I remind you folks about the contest. 
There we go. The right temperature, 39 degrees. That's great. It's fantastic. Eh, maybe it's useful for you, especially you farmers, you big landowners. Maybe this would be something useful. Okay, guys. Talk to you again soon. Alec Pierce at the ranch. Mm -hmm.